Hey there guys, Penguins Recordings here and today I'm going to be showcasing how to install SimCity 4 Deluxe Edition on Ubuntu uh, This is 13.04 but this should work for 12.04 and 12.10 as well and hopefully future version, versions So first you'll need Play on Linux Okay, The link to download this is in the description below So open up Play on Linux and the first thing we're going to do is we're going to install Steam So I click this install button here then I go down to this down here, install a non-listed program. Click that. Give it a couple seconds. Alright, click next. Now we want to select the first one. Install a program in the new, new virtual drive. I'm going to click next. Now you can name this drive anything you want, but I'm going to be descriptive and I'm going to call it SimCity 4. It's better if there's no spaces like they said, so I'll keep it like that. SimCity 4. Click next. Now in this part, you're going to want to tick use another version of Wine because here we're going to use the latest version of Wine. It's always best to use the latest. And this part, I'm going to tick configure Wine. This is optional. Basically, I want to put Wine into windowed mode. You can do this if you want to or not. Click next. Now which version of Wine would you like to use? At the time of this video, the latest version of Wine is 1.5.30. So I'm going to take... Oh, it looks like this is the only one I have here. Strange. Alright. I'm going to use this. 1.5.30. And I'm going to click Next. But before I do that, you might be figuring out... that You might find that you won't have this in your list. To add this latest Wine version to your Play on Linux list, you click Tools and then go to manage wine versions alright so this window will appear up here so you have the wine versions all on the left here these are the ones that you can install and then the ones on the right are the ones that you already have installed okay so if it appears here then you'll have it in here to install one you select it and then you click this button right here and it will bring it to this side and then you have it installed and you can close this so I'm going to continue the installation. So I'm going to select this, the latest one. I'm going to click Next. I'm going to leave the virtual drive to set itself up. This can take a couple of seconds or a couple of minutes, depending on your computer specs. Alright, so now we're going to configure Wine. This is optional for you guys, but I'm doing this because I want to put the Wine window into windowed mode. So we go to the Graphics tab, then we tick Emulate a Virtual Desktop. I'm going to set this to 1600 by 900. This is the resolution of the window I want to set it to. You can set it to anything else you want. It's up to you. Click Apply, click OK. So now we're going to install Steam. This guide is for the Steam version of SimCity 4 Deluxe. If you have the version without Steam, you can skip installing Steam and straight away head to the setup.exe for your SimCity 4. Alright, so I'm going to click Browse. I'm going to go to Desktop. Now I'm going to go to Steam install.msi, this one right here. I'm going to click Open. Alright, now I'm going to click Next. Alright, so it says welcome to Steam. This is the standard installation of Steam. I'll just click next. Go through this quickly. English. Yep. No need to change any of those. Finish. Now the updating procedure can take a while, depending on whether your internet is fast or not, and if you have a good connection to Steam servers or not. I'm not sure if I have a good connection this time around. Alright, so this part can take a while. I will skip ahead to after this is finished updating. Alright, so we're almost done with the updating part of Steam here. Just a little bit more before it finishes. A little bit more. And it's done updating. So now it's going to install itself.
This is why I like to run it in windowed mode, so it doesn't affect anything else outside. It doesn't affect the rest of the operating system, it can do its own thing. Alright, so you can see there's no text here. That's okay, we will fix that in a moment. So I'm going to close it. We're not logging in now. We close it first. Alright. Scanning the drive. Okay. We're going to make one link for this. We're going to name it Steam. Okay. This is the shortcut to Steam. But I'm also going to call it Steam Sim City 4. So I know what I have this for. I click next. Okay, we're done with making the shortcuts. I don't want to make another shortcut, so I double click that. Now we have Steam installed, but we do not have SimCity 4 installed yet. So we're going to configure this. Select the Steam we just installed and click configure. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to fix that no text issue. We're going to put dash no dash d right okay I'm going to hit enter All right. so what we've just done is make sure that there will be text for steam close that now we're going to run it again alright so now we have text so now I'm going to log into an existing account which is my account I will censor my input details here Now, since this is a new wine prefix, it's going to ask me for this Steam Guard key. Now, if you're familiar with Steam, then basically you just go to your email and they'll have sent you a key. You just copy that and then you paste it here. So I'm going to skip this part of the video while I get it from my email. Alright, so I'm going to paste my key in here. So there I have my key. Click Next. It'll take a while to verify. Alright, so it's done. Click finish and it will continue to log in. First time login can take a while for it to start up. Today I'm having particularly slow internet, so it is taking a lot longer for me. Alright, so finally it has started up. Now I'm going to go to library and I'm going to head to my SimCity part here. Where is it? SimCity 4. SI, there it is. SimCity 4 Deluxe. Now, for most of you, you guys are going to click install and then you're going to click next and you're going to let it download. Now, to save myself bandwidth and time, I've already backed up the game. So I'm just going to go to Steam, Backup and Restore Games. I'm going to go to Restore Previous Backup. Next, Browse. It's on my other hard drive. If you backed up the game like me, then this is how it's generally done. But if you just downloading it, then you can click the Install button. Steam Backup 2. SimCity 4 Deluxe, select that. Next. It's about 1.2 1, 1 gig. It's very small for current games. Click Next. Alright, so it's finished installing itself. Click Finish. Now, before I start it up, this is an old game, so it doesn't support most of the new resolutions. So I right click it, I go to properties, and I set launch options. Now I'm going to put a dash custom resolution enabled. I hope I'm doing that correctly. Dash R 1600 by 900 
and 32 bits per pixel. So what I'm doing here is I'm enabling custom resolution and I'm setting it to 1600 by 900 which is the resolution of this window. So I click OK, click close, and I click play. Play. Now hopefully it should start up just like that straight off the bat. Oh, I forgot to record the sound, so I'm going to use my headphones instead. I'll give you guys a bit of the sound. It does work though. You can see there was no additional difficulty setting up. No need for wine tricks or anything. Skip that. So this is pre pre basically a clean wine prefix. The latest to that. So these are my previous saves. Steam stores the saves in the Steam Cloud, so whenever you're installing it on a new computer or anything, you always have your save files accessible. So let's see, under settings, everything is enabled. Uh, display, everything is enabled. Well, these are put down a bit. I can put these to high if I want to. Okay, accept. Let's take a look at one of the towns I already have. Sorry, I forgot to record the sound, so instead I'm using my headphones to put the sound here. No, I don't want to. So you can see it works great without any additional work done on it. Scrolling in and out, moving around. This is the town I've made while I've been playing in wine. So you guys can see that it does work. I have a bustling town here. Okay, now. So I hope this video helps you guys get the game installed. If you have the non Steam version, then you can skip installing Steam and instead go straight to the setup.exe of your SimCity 4 Deluxe Edition game. So thanks for watching guys, I hope this video helps.